and I'm back with uh, another simple little tutorial. Uh, we're going to keep on rolling with this uh, server that we're building and uh, which is the HTTP server and the FTP server and uh, in these next couple of videos I plan on uh, us doing a little bit more with the uh, client side because we have the, serv the basic server side down that's good for right now now we just need to start getting the client side alright so once again the server this will be running what's on the server provides the service the client side is what the end user is going to be running so if you're let's say a business that's if you're a web hosting business this is the side you will be dealing with running the server this is what your client will be using your client will be using a FTP client so let's take a look at the FTP uh, client source everything that you see that is in red with a little hash mark next to it or number sign that means it's commented out in Python and I'm not going to be talking about that in this video what I'm going to be talking about is right here the FTP login so what happens whenever we run our server Python server.py so we're in we can run our client I need to put this in a much easier directory this python ftp client.py so right now all we can do is we can list what's in the directory and uh, if you notice right now it says user Todd and the pass is blanked out but in the previous videos if you paid attention to that if we took out this right here we re-ran that code and looked it would say anonymous because whenever we don't have any arguments in the parameters of FTP login we are simply accessing this which is the anonymous there's no username and password it just gives us a directory that we are allowed to access now whenever we get into things such as uploading files, deleting files you actually need like uh, permissions to do it to do all that and usually you're gonna have users you don't want to give everybody the permissions to be able to upload, delete, edit files that's not good because anonymous login that's everybody so here we have one user which is Todd that's going to be the login name and the password is 123 so just like you see right here we have Todd 123 username password it's just like that here 123 run it that's the server here's going to be our client window once again Todd password and uh, what I'm also going to be uh, just going to go really quickly over what I'm going to do in the next video. Uh, the next video, I'm going to get into basically uploading a file, which you need a user with proper permissions to do it. So if you notice this perm right here, <coughs> this is going to be the argument telling it what kind of permissions Todd has. <coughs> so quick rundown of this again. It's very short, sweet, easy. Whenever we do FTP login and it takes the arguments of Todd and one two three, it accesses this user, and it completely ignores anonymous because we're not going to be logged in as anonymous. We take out these parameters, and whenever we run this code, it's going to ignore user Todd, and it's going to run this. Alright, so fairly simple idea. Let me put that back, save it, and uh, 